It's not my son. It's just a body that I feed and wash and clothe. <laughs> Hi, Mary. Hi, Dr. Wilson. How's Stephen doing? Same as last week, the week before. I lost him that day. I lost Richard in the car. The next patient is waiting for you in the office. He's dealing with a lot of grief after his mom died. They're moving him to Boston. Is that really necessary? He can just stay here. It's like I have my little boy back. Hi, Mary. Hi. How's it all going? To tell you the truth, I think it'll be good for all of us. Tom! Tom? Tom! Authorities have stated the missing child could not have survived the severe drop in temperatures. I feel so guilty. You cannot blame yourself. I haven't been sleeping that well. I saw Tom. But everybody's been saying he's dead. Your sleep problems are making it difficult for you to distinguish your nightmares from reality. No, something is happening. Steven has scratches on his face. Listen to what you're saying. You're talking about ghosts. Something's going on, and it's not just in my head. I can prove it. I'm gonna get you out of here. You have to believe me. It's real. Okay, action-adventure fans. Ever wondered what the top 10 action-adventure movies of all time are? Well, here is a list according to Rotten Tomatoes. Coming in at number 10 is Catherine Bigelow's The Hurt Locker from 2009. At number 9 is Christopher Nolan's The Dark Knight. And number 8 is Disney's Zootopia. The Treasure of the Sierra Madre, starring Henry Bogart, is at number 7. And number 6 is Seven Samurai from 1956. Another animation movie, this time Up, is at number 5. While Errol Flynn's The Adventures of Robin Hood is at number 4. Number 3 is 1933's uh, King Kong. And number 2 is Fritz Lang's Metropolis. And topping off the list at number 1 is, and I must say, I so agree with this, Mad Max Fury Road. Okay, so do you agree with this list? What would be your top 10? Let me know in the comments below and remember to subscribe to our channel for all the latest trailer releases. See ya!